Hey guys, I'm Lila and welcome to this calorie burning belly dance workout where all levels are welcome. Are you ready? Okay, we're going to start with moving our hips side to side. So this is just the warm up, take it nice and easy, just working onto the side abs. I'm going to tell you a little bit about my friends here. <laughs> this is Megan and this is Alejandro. Hi. Megan here. <laughs> Megan here is going to be showing you the alternative moves that you want to do if you're not feeling completely advanced today or if you want to take it a step easier. If you're just beginning, if you're a beginner, you're going to follow her. Great, we're going to take the wrist and up. Really sinking into those knees a little bit more. Two more. And lift. One more. We're going to start to kick our feet all the way back. Let's get that jump in. Really squeezing into these sides, lifting those hips. Four, three, two, lovely. Let's bring those hands. Switch, 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 switch. Take it all the way back. Great, just walking those legs to the side. We're gonna start by sliding. Feel free to get those arms up to the side. Feel really good with this movement. Four, three, we're gonna add some little twists. So stand here, twist. So here what we're doing is warming up the core. Slide, twist, one more. We're gonna take it to drops. Lovely. Okay, getting straight back to the core. We're gonna take it into chest circles. Slide. One more. From the top, slide, twist. Two more. Take it to those hip drops. Chest circles. Big and round. Lovely. Well done. Okay, we're gonna pass feet a little bit over here. We're gonna leave those shoulders nice and back and start with our arms coming in. We swing, lift, swing together. You can double the time if you want, or you can stay nice and slow. Lift. Let's double that up. Perfect, stay with that. Four more, four, three, higher, two, one. Hold it there. We're gonna tuck in the pelvis and release. So you've got this really beautiful stretch just behind our legs. And we're making sure that the hips are really nice and warm. This is belly dancing. <laughs> and we got a lot of hip work coming. <laughs> Perfect. Circle, side, forward, side, back, side, forward, side. Let's take it the other way. Side, forward, side, back, side, forward, side, back. Lovely. Release. Take that all the way up. We're going to take some to a small choo choo shimmy. So we've got the shoulders back. We've got these tiny steps on the ball of our feet. And we don't have to worry too much about our hips. Just let them loose, let those feet, let those calves do all the work. Literally, you're gonna be feeling it quite a lot on your calves today as well. From here, we're gonna go shoulder roll. Get those nice bends in our knees. And take it forward. Really working up in towards the ear so that you can get the really nice rounding in the back. And then we get a bit more belly dancery. One, two, three, alternating on. How are you feeling? Cool. <laughs> Other side, take it forward. Okay, we've got a little bit more chest work here. Lift, drop, lift, drop. We're going to plant our hands kind of on our hips so you have control. We're going to take it side to side, side, side. And you can, again, try and keep that control by handing your hands on your hips. Lovely, relax. Okay, are we ready to begin? <laughs> are we ready? Yes, we are. Okay, so the first move we're going to do is very correlated. We're going to have our hands out to the side, feet together. Twist, 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 twist. So what we're doing is taking it from one diagonal to the other and keeping control using that core. Let's double it up. What happens here is you become a shimmy. Become the twist shimmy. Amazing. Okay, what we're doing is placing our arms and wrists around. One, two, one, two, one, two. Trying to keep the upper part of our body really nice and relaxed. Keep breathing. 
We've got a new move coming. Hip, hip. So the most important thing about this move is that you're squeezing the glutes and really sinking into the movement. When you sink into the movement, you're squeezing and kicking it out. They're called hip kicks because you're trying to kick that wall to the side. From the top, double. You got it? We're going to go through it another 100 times that so you do. <laughs> Squeeze that core, get those plates working. Remember, you don't have to do the three. You can stick to just one to each side. Do you want a modification? Lovely. Control, core, and hip. Okay, we're going to the next move. Step, side, body roll. Step, side, body roll. Two, two shimmy, which we did in the warm up. Step, side, body roll. Body roll, tiny steps, keep those feet together. Send it all the way back. Side, step, body roll. Really working up through the core. Turn around, nice and upright, pushing back. Step, add the hand if you're comfortable. Turn around and send it back again. Body roll, cross step, body roll, lovely. One more, <laughs> lovely. Big chest, turn around. Keep that head nice and high, keep smiling. We're gonna hold it here and we're gonna take it from the top. Four, three, two, one, twist. Twist again, twist. Back into that step forward. Body roll, beautiful. Body roll, take it all the way around. And again. Hip, again. Keep that core engaged. Step forward. Body roll, lovely. Take it around. How are you feeling at home? <laughs> Great. <laughs> again. Really feeling it. Great. <laughs> Kind of like going everywhere right now. Take it forward, step, body roll, step, body roll, take it around. And back. One more time. Again. Really squeezing those glutes. Step forward. We're trying to get the most out of this workout. Burn as many calories as we can. And take it forward. This is the last one. We're gonna stay here. Stay on this, lovely. Stay, again. <laughs> and give yourself a pose. Well done, ladies. Woo! So that was our first track okay. we've just gone through. <laughs> How are you feeling? Hi. Ready for some more? <laughs> Great, so awesome. this is hot. <laughs> our drum solo little section here. We're gonna just start with a really simple move where we're gonna step back this leg. Step, forward, Together, other side, step, together. We can get faster, can't we? Yeah. We got this going, let's go. With the hands, if you want, really sinking into that move. Don't worry about anything else, just that leg work. Four, three, two, beautiful. One, hold it there. We're gonna do this choo-choo shimmy and add the hands coming all the way and there and halfway and lift. So you have to imagine that these two beach balls and then you let them go. Growing, release. How your calves feeling? <laughs> From the top, one, straight into it, lift and down. Side, side, lift and down. Again. One more. Take it to his chest, shimmy to the side. Step, and chest, and chest. Lift, drop. This is all controlled from that core. Release, and drop. From the top. Lift, and again. Lift, take it into that shimmy. Shimmy again. Hopping back. One, two, three, five. From 
the top. You got this. Take it back. Take it back. Shimmy. Again. Chest shimmy to the side. And drop. Beautiful. And drop again. All the way to those hops. One, two, three. Again. Lovely. Back. Amazing, well done. Okay, we're gonna take it back. So we're gonna start by small steps forward, cross, back, cross, double up. So these are our crossed out box steps, kind of. It's a little bit more of an 80s move, but we're throwing it in today because we can be 80s, why not? <laughs> Got the shimmy. <laughs> too much for the shimmy and the feet you can always just choose one choose your favorite and then next time you can do both stop here we got the hips hip hip lift drop hip hip lift drop if you really want to get those calorie burnt today if that makes sense what you want to do is squeeze into the hips and really work on lifting that chest up and down without the shoulders involved keep the shoulders nice and relaxed from the top oh very nice hips Lovely. Again. This is your breather here, okay? Hip, hip, lift. Hip, hip, one more time. I think my favorite move is next, by the way. <laughs> we got back. One, two, three, four. Shoulder rolls. Choo choo, shimmy back. Look at the audience, me, and then shoulder up. Look at me, shoulder roll, very nice. So this is a really fast move, and then contrasting this beautiful slow shoulder movement. Beautiful, two more. One more, let's go, very nice. And take it into the center, we're gonna start all this from the beginning. Do you remember it all? Let's go. Take it to those hips. Straight into choo-choo, shoulders, choo-choo, shoulders. One more time, choo-choo, let's go. And if you don't know what choo-choo shimmy is, <laughs> now you do. <laughs> Perfect, we've got a new move. Take it to the side, one, two, three, four, and back. Nice light jumps, using that core to let you go side to side, really twisting, and back. One more time, then we're gonna take it straight from the top. Let's go from the top. Breathe. One more time. Very nice. Squeeze. Into those choo-choo shimmies to the side. Shoulders. Into the jumps. Repeat. Let's try one more time. Can we do this? Show me. Just one time hip. Hip, hip. Again, one more. Two, 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 me to the side. Shoulder roll. Other side, lovely. And we're gonna end on this nice move. Side and back. Beautiful. Stay here, we're gonna go one more time. Keep breathing. Last time, two, one. Very nice. Well done, guys. How are you feeling? Ooh. Okay, a bit hot, a bit sweaty, that's good. Oh, yeah. We're gonna I'm see. <laughs> are you good? You yeah. good? <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go into our next drum solo section, which is super fun. We have these really nice Saidi hops. We're gonna start with soft knees. This is the Egyptian shimmy. So one knee comes forward, the other knee goes back. But you don't want to ever lock your knees. You want to keep them nice and soft the entire time. So as we go a little bit faster, keeping that body nice and upright, you'll start to notice, and this comes with practice. So if you want to choose your own shimmy, which is like a hip shimmy or anything else, you can do that at home. But if you're ready to really try to get this Egyptian shimmy down, you'll start to notice that your belly is going side to side. Okay, we're gonna start layering, you ready? <laughs> Hand comes, one, two, release. Stay with that. 
release. And this is not easy. We're just smiling because we're pretending. It's easy, isn't it? <laughs> so true. You know? We're just like, yeah, we're totally fine. <laughs> Perfect. Let's just do a few more of these so you get the movement in your body. And like I said, practice, practice, practice. Okay, we're going to take it to our step hops. Step, hop, step, hop, choo-choo shimmy. Take it to the side. Step, hop, step, hop, hold. From the beginning, Ooh. let's go. Step, take it back to the side. Step, beautiful. Straight into it. No stopping this time. I want you to get all these moves right into that body. Burn those calories straight away. Stay. Okay, for all of you people who have already got this down, I'm going to start adding those hands. Okay, I think I've already added some. <laughs> Lift. But this is the additional hand movement. Opposite leg, opposite hand. Step, let the back of the hands touch. Send it all the way back. One at a time. Step, lift, lift, all the way back. Step, side, step, hold. Shimmy, shimmy. Very nice. <laughs> well done. So that was just a little bit of touching on a different style of belly dancing. We can go straight to a really fun one, which is a bit more active, so make sure you have some space. Starting with these nice slides. Slide. So really want to open up the hands. Now this is a really beautiful move, especially because while you're doing it, <laughs> you're feeling some air in your face and you're like, I feel so refreshed right now. <laughs> Do you feel that? No yeah. music. <laughs> Lovely. So from here, we're going to do two of these and take it into a turn. I'm going to show you now. We got one, turn around. One, two, three, jump. Step, step. One, two, three, jump. Step. If you prefer not to turn, just do two steps. I'll show you. One, two, you can do this instead, okay? Perfect. Just feel, if you're feeling dizzy, no need to feel dizzy today. Lovely, from here, hip, two, three, four, half a turn, two jumps. Four hips, take it halfway, two jumps. Four hips, really squeeze into those glutes. And if you don't want to turn to the back, Turn to the front, okay? Perfect. One. So you get that really nice shimmy feeling when you really squeeze this one leg here. Beautiful. From the top, arms. Turn around. Again, lovely. Turn around, take into four hips. One, two, three, four. Turn around. Two jumps. From the top, beautiful. Side, side, turn around, jump, side. Take into those hips. One more time. And then we've got a new move for you, which you've kind of done before, so don't worry too much at home. It's okay. <laughs> For one, two, three, four. Again. Take it to the center, choo choo shimmy. Lift, down, chest circle. Lovely. Lift, down, chest circle. If you want, you can just do this. Down, chest lift. Very nice. Lift, down, chest lift. It's up to you. But a little bit more advanced would be the circles. And really get into them. Involve your shoulders if you want today. Find your favorite side to circle on as well. Everybody has a favorite side. You're still working that core no matter which way you go. Are you ready from the top? Side. Beautiful. Have fun. Let's keep going. Beautiful. Four hips. Choo choo to the front. Two circles, choo choo again. Two circles, choo choo again. I'm making you do this four times. Why? Because I care about the muscles in your body 
And I know this burns calories from the top. Beautiful. Four. Find your pose. Very nice. Well done, ladies. <laughs> well done, ladies at home. I hope it's going really well for you. We've got a little bit of um, a relaxing one. I'm lying. It's okay. <laughs> this is going to be fun, but when I say relaxing, I just mean we've got a tuck stem. So we're going to place our feet nice and comfortably, side hips nice and level with our knees and our shoulders nice and back. We step together, step, double time. These are what I call salsa legs, but we're squeezing the glutes. So you've got the hips involved, hips. Can you see that little push out? If I don't have the push out, it's just like this. If you want to squeeze the glutes, then you're activating all the muscles from the core to the glutes as well. Let's add the hands, hands, same hand as the leg. We let the hand come out in front of us like a snake. We have those hands coming slower than the rest of the body. Nice and relaxed. Perfect. Now we're really going to isolate the core now and work on those chest shifts. Hold. Shift, shift, shift. Shift, shift, shift. This is not easy, but it comes with practice. So this is where we're going to begin practicing today. With each one of these moves, you're stretching your sides and working into your obliques and really trying to stretch by holding onto your hips to make sure that you're going even further to the side. Lovely. We're gonna go two back step and side steps and then take it into these. Let's go. One, two, chest shift. Again, side, side. If these shifts are too quick for you, just do normal one, twos, that's all. You don't have to do three, two sides. Just do one to each side. One more time. Ready for the next section? We step, step, hip, hip, step. Hips come up into the obliques. We're using our knees to let that hip move up and down. This is different to hip kicks. They're very sharp, but you don't have to go sharp today. Lovely, and if you're very familiar with these terms, this is a half figure of eight to the side. <sighs> Lovely, which works again from the side core. We're gonna do two more and then take it from the top. Hold. Very nice. Well done, ladies. <laughs> How's it going at home? Are you starting to feel that all around here? I sure am. Okay, this is gonna be our final, final song. So we're going to go full on with this and we're going to start clapping at some point, right? We're going to start with sending that leg forward, back, forward, two jumps. Forward, you don't have to jump today. If you're feeling like just bouncing, that's fine. We're going to alternate legs if you're feeling up for that as well. And then we add the shimmy. Let's add the shimmy. Jump, jump. Jump. Job. Lovely. This time we're going to add that clap. Are you ready? Let's go. Beautiful. Stay with it. Okay, I've got one of my favorite moves to teach you right now. This is the Maya. We're going to take it to the side, up, side, down. Squeeze obliques, side, down. Take it in. It's an M shape. Lift side, down. It does feel strange. If it feels strange, that's normal. But if you want, we can just shift, shift to the side. So you can either go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, or you can shift. One, two, three. Find your favorite for today. Each one is going to work on this side out. Perfect. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, or shift. It's up to you. Really isolating those side abs. Five, six, seven, or it's up to you. Really, make your choice now. We're gonna take it forward, lovely. Double clap, other side. Take it into these Myers. One, two, three. Stay with it, do whatever feels good with your hands. Let's try that one more time from the top. Take 
Making those loose, Myers. One, two, three, four. Stay with this. Keep those knees nice and soft so you're able to get that full motion. Perfect. Take it to the side. These are our fun hip moves. One, two, three, four. Choo choo shimmy. Other side. Drop, 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 drop. I'm sure you've seen these before. <laughs> and choo choo feet together. And take it all the way around. Beautiful. You have full control of those arms. Let them be loose, let them turn. You can get excited about that if you want. <laughs> okay. From the top, yeah. Straight into those Myers. One more eight. Eight, seven. Straight into those hips. Choo choo shimmy. Stay with it. Beautiful. From the top. Repeat, repeat, same thing. Room on this side. <laughs> Keep clapping. <laughs> like when is it end? <laughs> well done, you guys did amazing back at home. And if you got all the moves, that's brilliant. If you didn't, that's fine. Just do it again with us, because we love dancing with you. It feels so good. <laughs> it does, yes. Yeah. Um, let's take those shoulders back. We're going to give ourselves a little bit of a cool down. So we're going to start by simply bringing our arms in. We exhale, reaching all the way up, and take it back down. We hug our body and release. All the way, lovely. Stretching through our arms, stretching our hips, really relaxing into each move, and release. Lovely, from there what we can do is just take it behind us, open up our chest, let our shoulders come a little bit forward when we drop down, and we release. So it's a whole body stretch. Opening from our chest, bring those elbows into the side and then just collapse those shoulders down so you get a nice stretch behind your legs. Open up and exhale down. We've got one more of these. I do love this movement. You can really sink into it and really stretch from that core. And exhale, hold it down. While you're holding it down, we're going to take your hands to one leg and straight to the other leg. And straight back to the other side. And straight back. Lovely. From here, just release. Slowly coming up. Get that hair out your face <laughs> if you can. Bring those hands up to the side and stretch all the way. We did a lot of side abs, so we really want to stretch it out. Exhale. And bring those arms around. And release it to the other side. And again, wave those hands all the way around. And release. You should feel really nice stretching. Really proud of yourself for getting through that. And release. Lovely. We're going to bring those feet in. And we did a lot of choo-choo shimmy, so we're going to bring that foot up, our heels on the ground. We're going to exhale, and we bring our pelvis down nice and controlled. When you feel that stretch behind the calf muscle, behind the leg, you can just hold. Lovely. We exhale, send it all the way up. Control from the core. And release the other foot coming. Feel that little bum? Oh, yeah. bring it. Yeah. <laughs> it's always one foot a little bit more than the other. And then the other side. Perfect. And release. One more time to the other side. And exhale. Lovely. From here, bring those hands behind us. Interlace our fingers. And we're just going to stretch, really stretching our chest, stretching our core, letting our shoulders relax. One more deep breath in, exhale, and folding forward so we get a little bit of a big hug. It's kind of like hugging your body, but what I want you to do is stretch out your back. Perfect, and release those shoulders. Bring one hand into the side, take it up, and we're looking to the opposite direction. Do another bit more, what we can do is rotate that, that wrist, so you can just play around with those hand movements. Lovely, and swing to the other side, bring the other hand over looking to the opposite direction, and then rotating those wrists. Perfect. And we're going to send that all the way up. Bring one knee to a bend, 
hold on to it. You can try and find a spot on the wall that you can look at. This will help you with your balance. And then lift your other hand up. You can bring your pelvis a little bit forward if you want a deeper stretch. And then again, you can play around with that hand. If you're feeling like you're gonna fall, <laughs> hold on to something. <laughs> or hold on to me, you can hold on to me. Lovely, and release that leg. And take it to the other side, one hand comes up. We hold on to the opposite, oh, a little bit off balance here. Gonna focus on you. <laughs> and then we can rotate the wrist. Why? I don't know, I think it's fun. <laughs> Perfect, and release. We've got time for one tiny bit more stretch. We're just gonna cross over to a pretzel shape. Sinking down into those hips. It is important to stretch out your hips and your glutes after belly dancing. This is quite difficult. If you need something to hold on to at home, hold on to a wall or a bar or a chair. I don't know, what other things? Or your friend. <laughs> Whatever's good for you. And release. And take it to the other side. So you're going to bring up that foot all the way. You're going to bend it a little bit. Sink it down. And you can also use your elbow if you need a little bit more um, support to push down that knee. And we hold here for three, for two, for one. Then we're going to inhale, breathing all the way up. Take your hands into the center. Give yourself a little bit of a shimmy and then just give yourself a clap. <laughs> well done, ladies at home. I really hope you enjoyed that workout and you got a lot out of it, a lot of smiles. And I will see you soon. Bye for now.